the This is a PUBG test with the Redmi K30 Ultra with the GFX tool. Uh, everything is maxed, graphics, shadows, lighting, uh, you name it, details, uh, uh, HDR quality. And of course, this is using the extreme 60 FPS mode. Check this out. Check this out, bro. Amazing. Amazing. FPS but you will feel later on ninjas after 10 minutes of the gaming since this uh, device does throttle a bit uh, the performance of PUBG will not be exactly the same as like right now this first minute it will you will see later on you will feel lag ninjas you will feel lag it's not gonna be catastrophical lag but you will feel it ninjas it's not gonna be smooth like this you can check that in my full battery drain test with the PUBG gaming for one hour with the Redmi K30 Ultra on my YouTube channel, so please make sure to check it out. And the phone does heat up ninjas, so it overheats. After 20 minutes of gaming with the PUBG, you can get ninjas on the battery 46, 47 Celsius. On the battery, that is crazy. The physical temperature also will be around 47. Ninjas, welcome back. Assalamu alaikum. So this is Medout 2 with the Redmi K30 Ultra Dimensity 1000 Plus. What a beast bro, what a beast, I have to admit I'm really really satisfied, uh, finally finally MediaTek came to the close up to the flagship level, maybe not like Bionic A13 or Snapdragon A65 Plus or Kirin 990, but Ninjas, it's close, it's there, it's finally, it's finally here, check it out here, the Madout how is running on maximum maximum graphics, Dimensity 1000 Plus, 
uh, half million of coins on Tantutu. Uh, indeed, indeed, Ninjas, this is a really great flagship gaming phone. Uh, you can't say that it's a mid ranger. Whoever says that, he basically doesn't know what he's talking about. This is a proper flagship chip, a proper flagship smartphone, Ninjas. Uh, one of the best values next to the Redmi K30 Pro. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, we have to test Nimi and Legends also on maximum graphics, maximum resolution 1080p, which I test uh, with these phones, flagship smartphones. Yes, yes, uh, this game right now it's showing us that it is not on the level of the Snapdragon A65, A65 Plus, but uh, I didn't expect that obviously. But it is close in the gaming performance, it is close to the Snapdragon A55 Ninjas. Of course, overall, you should go with the Snapdragon A55 or A55 Plus, don't get me wrong. But it is very close, bro. This is, hey, bro, remember, this is a MediaTek chipset. This is a MediaTek company. Three years ago, everybody was bashing MediaTek chipsets. Uh, they didn't like it at all. Uh, but well, we've been praising it only if, when it came with the Redmi Note series, the Halo X20. Uh, people were praising it. But Halo P60 and Halo P70 were a decent chipset. Halo P60 for the price was good. Anyway, good performance for now. And just welcome back. Assalamu alaikum. So this is Medout 2 with the Redmi K30 Ultra Dimensity 1000 Plus. What a beast, bro. What a beast. I have to admit, I'm really, really satisfied. Uh, finally, finally, MediaTek came to the close up to the flagship level. Maybe not like Bionic A13 or Snapdragon A65 Plus or Kirin 990, but Ninjas, it's close. It's there. It's finally, it's finally here. Check it out here. The Medout how is running on maximum, maximum graphics, Dimensity 1000 Plus. Uh, half million of coins on Tantutu. Uh, indeed, indeed, Ninjas, this is a really great flagship gaming phone. Uh, you can't say that it's a mid-ranger. Whoever says that, he basically doesn't know what he's talking about. This is a proper flagship chip, a proper flagship smartphone, Ninjas. Uh, one of the best values next to the Redmi K30 Pro. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, we have to test Nimi and Legends also. On maximum graphics, maximum resolution 1080p, which I test uh, with these phones, flagship smartphones. Yes, yes, uh, this game right now, it's showing us that it is not on the level of the Snapdragon A65, A65 Plus, but uh, I didn't expect that, obviously. But it is close in the gaming performance, it is close to the Snapdragon A55 Ninjas. 
Of course, overall, you should go with the Snapdragon A55 or A55 Plus, don't get me wrong. But it is very close, bro. This is here, bro. Remember, this is MediaTek chipset. This is MediaTek company. Three years ago, everybody was bashing MediaTek chipsets. Uh, they didn't like it at all. Uh, but well, we've been praising it only if, when it came with the Redmi Note series, the Halo X20. Uh, people were praising it. But Halo P60 and Halo P70 were a decent chipset. Halo P60 for the price was good. Anyway, good performance for now.